Okay, team, let's be real here. Things are not going so well. Frankly, extroverted feeling, on the last meeting we had, all you did was talk. You said nothing of value during the whole entire meeting. Your yokes were a distraction from getting anything productive done. An extroverted intuition, honestly, your ideas are just outrageous. What are you thinking? When, we, when will we ever have time for that? How do you expect us to be able to build a spaceship in a two week time frame, frame for a school project? You make no sense. An introverted sensing? I saw you sitting in the corner sulking that entire time last week, and I saw you thinking a lot of things, but you never said anything out loud. Why are you not talking? Why are you not saying anything? You need to be more open. Hey, give, ex give introverted sensing a bit of a break. Come on. I, you know, it's not easy to be introverted sensing. Just the other night, she had to spend four hours trying to figure out logical connections for extorted intuition. So you know how much bullshit she has to filter through on a daily basis? Besides, I feel like we did a lot last week. We bonded, we created a good atmosphere, we had fun, we made some good jokes. I know extroverted intuition was laughing a lot. And at some point, the introverted thinking, I think I saw even you smirk a little bit, unless that was rage. Guys, guys, while you were talking, I was researching this next big trip we could make. So for a school project, how about we go to San Francisco? So what we could do is we could, I don't know, do something about the bridge or perhaps like a nice social psychology experiment. What happens if you punch somebody in the face on a bridge? What do they do? How do people react to that kind of a situation? Or maybe p punching is a bit extreme. Uh, what do you think, Inverted Sensei? What do I think? What do I think? I think you're absolutely outrageous. Do you know, do you have any idea where we would get the money to finance such a trip after you spent all our budget on stupid purple stickers that you thought looked cool and these helium canteens why would we ever need helium what was the point i don't get you and let's be fair there is no way our school is going to fund us going to san francisco to punch people in the face no 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 i think it's actually possible i'm really good friends with my teacher honestly she loves me i could get her to fund us doing anything I'm really good at arguing. You know, I could actually argue anyone into anything. So if I just talk really good, if I say just the right words, I am 100% we could get this trip through. Okay, yeah. but you're gonna have to promise me that you're going to actually get this through because I don't wanna spend all this time researching and thinking about it. I want to make sure 100% that we're actually be, gonna be able to go on this trip. And if we go, it's very important for me that we develop a clear methodology and a clear method so that we can get this done. So I don't want us to just go there. I want us to have a good scientific experiment with clear rules and that we want to make sure we looked at every single angle so that we can truly determine how things work. And I want us to develop some kind of groundbreaking insight from this. So I don't want us to just go there because it's fun. Honestly, I can't even hear you guys because I'm already in San Francisco, San Francisco, eat burritos and San Francisco.